The SteelSeries Apexes have landed. The new 9 TKL with its OptiPoint switch and the new OmniPoint have arrived here at Turbo Tortoise Tech. Good afternoon morning and welcome to Turbo Tools Tech. If you're new here, I'm Reese of the four-piece variety of Walker Triple XL. And I've been asked to give you guys a first look at the Apex 9 TKL because it's actually going on a competition right now with Eve Tech. So if you haven't entered the competition, do check out the link tree. There's a bunch over there you'll see. And one of them is for this Apex 9 TKL, which I have in front of me here. I've done the obligatory beauty shotting and a, just a general product inspection i haven't gotten to using it or messing with the opti points different activation levels these also have removable switches on this keyboard so a lot of really good updates honestly i'm really really amped about the removable switches from steel series because it means that this flat deck which is aluminium finished and the rest of the keyboard could be with you for quite some time because the moving part that breaks can now be replaced equally the keycap set can also obviously then be replaced so this is a much better more modular design and out of box i gotta say i do kind of like it i think that some of the plastics used especially like on the back could be a little bit better maybe but i'm not mad at it i like the brushed finish uh, much prefer it to gloss because it just doesn't track you know fingerprints and stuff they've got double layer kickstand on the bottom as well a really nice little hatch over here for a key puller that then sits underneath or a keycap puller that then sits underneath over there i don't know if it's going to be able to pull the switches as well because there wasn't a switch puller included so we'll see normally those are metallic um, but yeah nicely done with the rubberized little hatch over there and the foot that then is still rubberized and making contact with the bottom like i said the double kickstands is, are quite nice as well out of box performance just on a general thing i noticed that these have lubricated stabilizers but then the space bar not lubricated stabilizer why why is it also, <laughs> we are so close to perfection um to doing that quite well keycaps as well uh the shine through is a little touch weak uh not not the best but in a dark environment it does still do its job look and feel wise is pretty good i'd like the scroll and the button top left because they're doing the programmable set no led on this one they've kept that for the apex pro so we'll get into the led and what you can do on the keyboard with this one but on the face of things flat, like i said flat aluminium deck replaceable keycaps and switches they have done a pretty damn good job here so winning one of these means it could literally be the last keyboard you'll probably need and i think we can all agree uh, if you're not doing excel then tkl is absolutely perfect and so yeah you the, the it could literally be i mean because of that because they've done the replaceable switches it could be replaceable so gator and opties are what you're going to be able to win this here apex 9 tkl i hope you've enjoyed this first little look i will be doing a full review on both of these keyboards early into next week i'm going to be using them over the next couple of days and really get into their paces and what it's like to use but on the face of things these do look very promising if you have enjoyed this please do hit us up with a like and subscribe and hope to see you in the competition